Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play King's Quest 6. Air today, going tomorrow, while at work. Unless we left off, I disarm the trap. And I'm not dead. Alright, now I can go update my map again. Next. Shush you. Here's a low growling, so faint as to seem born of his fired imagination rather than of any living creature. Can I go down? That's what she. Yes. Alright, let's go east. Dead end. Niches in the wall form. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so let me use my little hole. Do do. Alexander puts the hole on the wall. Shudder and revulsion at the mere touch of the cold stone. All right. Can I see anything? Alexander peers through the hole in the wall and sees nothing of interest. Uh Out hole in the wall, off the wall. Yes, we know. The beast is growling at us. Oh. Okay. That gives us here. And we want to go east. Um. Sounds a trap floor. Oh, watching. I was drawing on my map. Am I alive? Alexander seems to have fallen to a lower level of the catacombs. Wherever he is, the place sure is dark. All Alexander right. Alexander can't even see his hand in front of his face. This isn't good. I've got my level 2 map now. Assuming that there actually will be a map for it. Oh, actually, it was very lucky. Glad I took this. Alexander takes the candle from his tinder box and uses the flint in the box to light it. So that's why it's dark in here. A torch is out. Alexander lights the extinguished torch and puts his tinderbox away. I just figured that the paintbrush would be some you would know exactly what to use it for. And that just seemed like an item. Well, as a tinderbox is something that yeah, you use it for light or. All right. He goes south. And Alexander hears the distant sounds of a wild animal. Yes, we know. We don't care anymore. All right. South again. Gives us his a west and a south. We'll go south again. go. I know this is probably extremely exciting for you guys watching, but uh, try not to fall off your seat and, you know, just be patient. <laughs> there we go. Let's go I know. So I don't care. As he walks through the doorway, Alexander gets a very bad feeling. Oh, I haven't control. been saving Freaking tickets! Oh, 
Only. Tickets Next. only. God darn it. Uh. Alright. The good news is, though, because I am doing my little math and not just wandering randomly, I know exactly where to go. And here, we fall onto level two. Now how come this ball doesn't zounds, kill us? A trap floor. Zounds! Who says zounds? Come on, Alex. You're tougher than that. Nobody says zounds. Alexander seems to have fallen to a lower level of the catacombs. Wherever he is, the place sure is dark. Ooh. Alexander can't even see his hand in front of his face. Alright. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted to do. Alexander takes the candle from his tinder box and uses the flint in the box to light it. Aha! So that's why it's dark in here. A torch is out. Alexander lights the extinguished torch and puts his tinderbox away. Alright. I do, uh... Just because it's me, I like to... Um, just be complete and thorough. So. Let's save again. Let's save on... This one. So I can go down two more times. That's what she said, that's what she said. And then west. Ba -ba -bum. Going south will kill me. So I'll go west again leads to a three-way... <laughs> They're rolling today, guys. Let's go west again. Alexander hears a low growl like that. Yes, I know. Uh oh. My map is going to be incomplete. To redraw here. Okay. This place is getting Some really confusing. Far off into the catacombs, the sounds of hooves faintly echo. If I go south, nothing. Dead end. Alright, folks, I'm going to cut the video off here, as always. Thank you very much for watching, and uh, when we come back, I'll still be continuing to explore. Thanks for watching, guys.